Lekker. Kom. And his face looks like like little like you know little like to me I don't know if it's bone fraction and his face. Did the coroner's report say what was that big hole that caused the big hole? They didn't put that in there. They didn't put that in there. Mm -mm. That's why that's why I'm gonna raise money where I can get my own um, autopsy. If I had to bring it back up to get it right, and he can go exactly tell me what is that, why was this cut, why was this so like that, he can be more give me more details. No one have ever sat down, even my lawyer, mm -hmm. sat with me to tell me what's, you know, equities picture. What I want them to show me in that 27 page report, and as well I want them to show me this autopsy they gave me. And I want them to equal up. My son, when the autopsy, they also did a drug, um, an alcohol test on him. No drugs, no alcohol in his system. Um, the skin mm -hmm. started tearing because they grabbed him by his neck and they pulled him back of the van. The van still had glass. They got glass. That glass, half of that glass scraped mm -hmm. him. So we know he was in pain because I forgot what it said because I looked that up. And, uh, I looked that up on the internet, and from this type of mark, it said it was enough pain that it would make him scream and holler. So that lets me know that he didn't, since I was out there, he didn't holler, so I know he was dead in that garage. So this cut, what I'm talking about right here. See, why was that cut? Yeah. And that's on the side. So, they, and then, you know what? They still can't even give me the answer today about this. Because they told me that you supposed to just get cut as a Y. And on the report, they said they cut him as a Y. But they did not say he was cut from the side. They didn't say all oh, this is what you see. They just not in the report. So that's what making me puzzled. What, what happened that day? What is the cover up? Well, it took them two years to give me something that I already know they're going to say. Justify. You know, see, that's what they posted. You see how it looks? You see right here is a Y? Mm -hmm. And see how they tried to cut, connect him right here? Because all this was, all his arm was like basically hanging. So all this had to be sewed, you know, together when they finished, after they finished doing what they're doing. And you can see his ribs look like they, you know, Those are not gross. as easy yeah. as mm -hmm. And you can tell, his, if you look at the picture by looking at his body, he don't even look like a normal stomach. His stomach look crooked. Hmm. You see, you can tell from the, his waist for how it is. And I stay up all the time at home, and the only thing I can do is go. This is under his arm too. Only thing I do is go over these these, these same pictures, cause I have to get some closure, you know. And I see that the, the Justice Department ain't, ain't for us, you know. They investigate themselves. They the one uh, murdered him, and then. On top of that, I took my son to the back to the camp. The camp, they said in the report that my son had outstanding felonies. Well, how did he have outstanding felonies where the program he was in was only six months to 12 months? It's a real rehabilitation program where they like if they school work, I mean, it, it help you counseling and have all that. So they did not mention that. And also, they never have once talked to his lawyer. You know, why his lawyer didn't even put an input? Why his lawyer could have said, well, if my client had outstanding, we still, he had a lawyer. So why nobody ever asked the input of his lawyer? Why nobody had an input to the, to the, um, the camp? Why is they left out? Why they walk away freight clean from this case? Only if they would have just took him, what I provide, the transportation, I provided the medical treatment like they told me. Why did they take him in? And we know for a fact that they know I had him because I told them who I was and what his James was to me. And I took him not once, if I'm not mistaken, but three times. And I forgot that I had the medical papers. And the medical paper, it's got the date, the time I signed in, and the time I took him over there, the time they did the work and everything, and they can show you what they did for, to him. And I have a copy of the prescription of medicine that they gave to him. 
So the point realized, why did they take James back?